You're all right. Sorry, I ain't been on for a while. Uh, we've been really fucking busy. Uh, we've got a guest appearance, actually. Harry! Get him to pop his head round a minute. <laughs> got fucking old Francis back, in we? Oh, fucking hell. Uh, right, so we're just finishing off the peaks up the top. Aaron and Frank are at the back. Tom and Amy are doing the left-hand side over there. They've got to do two courses today and then leave it and then do two courses tomorrow. Because we know what happens if you don't. <laughs> um, me and George are just up here trying to get this ready. Uh, I thought I'd leave them lot to lay and I'll just help get set up in front because we haven't got enough labour to bring layers. So I'd rather just let them crack on laying than uh, don't start right. Yeah, fast. I was about to say that. Oi, Jerry, go slow because you were stopping there. Yeah, George's going faster on camera, it's a bit like me. <laughs> Look how fast I can lay rings. Uh, so, yeah, uh, it's a bit annoying because we didn't have the 140 blocks here on site when we could have took these walls up and back had a lot more done. And now we've got to jump in and work around all the trusses. It's a nightmare, any bricklayer will tell you it's a fucking shit job. Uh, makes you want to jack until you go back onto a bottom lift and you've got loads of room again. But, um, <laughs> they got some uh, extra help in. Uh, they wanted me to take some block work up, which weren't ready for me to do. <coughs> the scaffold weren't ready. And I refused to do it um, because it weren't on to do, basically. Uh, and they'd done it anyway. And I think they had some people here till 12 o'clock last night doing it. And I told them that the crane wouldn't do it and it ain't safe. For, to put trusses on, but they still went ahead to do it anyway. And the crane driver turned up this morning was like, No, I ain't touching that. So they was here till 12 o'clock for no reason last night, <laughs> which I found quite funny actually. Um, we're gonna just, they're nearly done up the back over there, so they're gonna be coming over in a minute. Um, me and George is gonna carry on getting this the whole section down here ready because the chippies are still up here on the other side, they've still got work to do over there. So once it's loaded out down to the end, I'm going to drop back and help get laying through. And uh, block one is pretty much done, bar a couple of little like seals. We've got to go back and put some seals in, but that's done. Apart from that, Perfect. maybe a little bit of making good here and there. And then block three, which we're on now, will be pretty much done by probably the end of next week, hopefully. Um, and then block two, I've told them that there's no access to the scaffold that they've put us up on um, to get our materials up there, so I'm not doing it um, because there's a scaffold change uh, and there's no way to get up there safely and get stuff up there safely. So, however they only get it done is up to them. Um, but once it's all back to the same level and they can put the scaffold round, ring it around at the same height, then I'll go up and I'll get it ready. Um, for trusses, which is what we should have been doing in the first place. Uh, the basement ain't ready yet because we're waiting for tanking to go around that. Um, they're coming in tomorrow to do that, so we can go around through the bottom, around that tomorrow maybe, drop off of this, just so it's ready for scaffold, and then we can pop back up here and crack on up here. That's pretty much it. Um, so, yeah. Uh, oh, you're still recording. <laughs> oh, that's a wrap.